I, like many of you out there, take great pride in my home studio. And maybe you all out there can relate to this, but I just can't keep things organized. I mean, look at this. Everything is cluttered up on the desk, mashed together. And it feels like all these things don't have their own place. But I just got a package in the mail that I think is going to help fix that. Today, I'll be totally reorganizing my desk using the setup cockpit created by Belolo, the sponsor for today's video. Some assembly required. Okay, everything is just a mess. It's time to put this all back together, but better. Now this, this is much better. Now let me take you through each part of this setup because it really helps me stay creative and keep up with creative flow, whether I'm making music, creating a video, doing a live stream, all of that from one desk. I'm using a second monitor mounted onto the tablet stand on the setup cockpit. We gotta take care of those cables here. A couple right angle adapters will do. And now that the second monitor is lifted off the desk, I've got a lot more place for storage. Combine that with the cable organizers, I can keep every cable I need, whether it's for sampling or a USB cable for different controllers and gear, I can keep that all stowed safely underneath everything and out of sight, so it's just there when I need it. And now there's plenty of room for activities. Now I finally got a place for my stream deck as well, so I can control my stream, which you can see over there on a little PC monitor. I can change scenes with the stream deck and I use the Roland VR1 HD as my video mixer. So it changes the different arrangement of cameras. Everything that's happening on stream, I can see on that tiny little monitor in the back. Now, since we've made room for plenty of activities, I am constantly switching out gear, trying out new gear, bringing back old gear out of the closet. And the XTS stands by analog cases save my neck every time. They've got a couple sizes and they're also expandable so they can fit multiple pieces of gear. But it helps me go from like craning my neck over a piece of gear to now being able to actually sit back and actually like play on something and not feel sore after. Hugely useful part of this desk setup, especially since I'm constantly changing things in and out. Next, we've got the KRK monitors on the below low speaker stands which match the setup cockpit and the desk perfectly. And they help elevate the speaker so they're more at my ear level. And my main audio interface is the Focusrite Scarlett 8i6. This allows me to have multiple things plugged in all at once. All of those audio cables that you saw underneath the setup cockpit, those are for sampling. Those are plugged into the back of the interface. While on the front, I've got a quarter inch cable, which goes to my guitar and an XLR cable, which goes to an SM58, just a dynamic microphone that's ready for sampling or recording at any time. I use the Shure SM7B as my main mic for streaming and video usually. And in the spirit of having a place for everything, there's a place for my phone on this setup, as well as all of those little knickknacks that you always have on your desk. Like I've got my hard drive, I've got mics, audio cables, my little notebooks. All of that, which could look a lot like clutter, I'm hiding it with the setup cockpit on a little tray. And since I'm combining accessories for the setup cockpit and my phone is mounted in the middle of that storage, I've got a little place there just for my AirPods. But don't worry, my big headphones, the Sennheiser HD 650s, they have a place too on the headphone stand on the other side. Pens, highlighters, markers, scissors, paintbrushes, it all has a place. The paintbrushes aren't just for painting, by the way. You can keep your gear dust-free by just keeping a, a little paintbrush around, and every time a gear gets a little dusty, give it a little brush. Ah, and what's this? Not a mini MIDI keyboard. Actually, one of the biggest MIDI keyboards you can get, the Control S88 Mark III from Native Instruments. But you may be thinking, well, that's inconvenient. You have to turn over to the keyboard away from your computer to play it. But actually, it works out pretty well because there's a lot of DAW control on this keyboard, including transport control. I can record. I can turn my metronome on and off, undo and redo. So basically, if I'm writing music at this keyboard, I can fully control writing an idea or deleting it and going back and recording again. And then I can also browse through a bunch of sounds right from the keyboard as well. 
So I don't necessarily need to turn back to the computer. There's enough control right there on the keyboard that I can turn over to this keyboard and forget the computer is over there a lot of the time. There's something though that the sponsor of this video doesn't know though, and if, if you get some accessories from Belolo, you should know that you're actually also getting a free instrument. You see, each piece of the setup cockpit, accessories included, come with one of these. Maybe you've seen them before. A small wrench. And after you've finished mounting each accessory, you might find that you have a collection of these wrenches. And of course, you're thinking what every sane person who gets a collection of small wrenches is thinking. Why don't we turn that into an instrument? In all seriousness though, having a clean, organized setup does help me stay productive and also in my creative flow when I actually take the time to make things. There's nothing like being able to sit down at your desk and have everything just ready to go. You wanna just be able to sit down and be ready. And at this setup, I can sit down and make music in a second. I can sit down and record a video with a couple presses of a button. Same thing with live streaming. So if you're looking to keep your space more organized, check out the links down in the description to all of these desk accessories. And also let me know what you think of this setup in the comments down below. We'd love to hear how you keep your workspace organized at home. And uh, for now, that's gonna be it. Thank you all so much for watching. This has been Tatro. Have a good one.